Hi, it's Jen from Mum in the Madhouse and today I am going to demonstrate how to make um, watercolour indent cards um, um, like this one here. This is a Valentine's one that we've made. They're really simple to make and really fun for kids. You, All you need is some watercolour paper, watercolour paint, um, a stick or the back of a paintbrush and a paintbrush and some cards. So we're going to use our lovely water brush and um, we got these at Christmas and we really love them. The water is in the um, sort of in the brush itself and it comes out and we're just going to use red. So I'm just going to squeeze a bit of water in. Um, you want to make your paint quite wet initially for this and you'll see why. Um, and then just pop on your watercolour onto the paper. This is best with watercolour paper because um, it's a little bit fibrous so it comes off and you can use a skewer or the bottom of a paintbrush for this next bit. We've just got a wooden stick which um, I sharpened um, and it's perfect for it. And so then you just draw on what you want your pattern to be. Um, it could be happy birthday, it could be words, it could be anything. And you can leave it like that to dry or if you want it to be darker you go back to your paint pop a little more on and then just literally work it over and you can see where the indent has been it actually darkens off can you see that should i bring it a bit closer so that's how you make the watercolor bit and then you need to let that dry um, and then you just cut it out so as you can see there's one that we did and let's dry it's exactly the same you can see the indent on it and then what I do is I map that onto um, a card and just literally sort of layer it up so if you're working with younger children and um, this glue here is brilliant because it's got a thick end and a thin end just screw it off so there's the thin end with the pointy bit and there's the, the thicker end so that's great for if you want to you know just squeeze a bit on and go all the way to the edges it does take a little while to dry but you can literally pop it on like this and turn it over and just center that just by eye onto your mat and let that dry for older kids sticky dots are great or any other type of thing and with these you just peel and press them onto it and it's immediately adhesive and it's permanent stick so we could literally just do this around the whole edge simple as that you turn your card over and just mount it and there we have a watercolour indent Valentine's card to give to the one that you love. And like I said, you don't need to stick at hearts. Um, you can do pretty much anything you want. Um, brilliant for birthday cards or thank yous. It's a great way of doing it. So again, you can just pop it on and you could do stripes or anything like that and pop your words on. And you can leave it like that and have it so that it's very sort of or you can go over it and make it slightly darker and there you have. thanks really simple technique once you've figured it out you can use it for all sorts of things